so today we have a Baba Nonya epic special. <laughs> <laughs> I like to think I'm a perfectionist. I, I'm not the sort to give up so easily. Mm. So, I mean, there were many times I wanted to give up, yeah. but I would never be the one to throw in the towel. I was just waiting for them to say, you know what, Pierre, just... Really? Yeah. So you'd rather wait in there and like, if they were to get pissed with you, pissed enough with you, you'd rather they call it quits rather than you did. Yeah, it was tough. It still is very tough. I mean, I, I can go on to set and sometimes, the lines are meant to be read a certain way. I, I read it during the, the script read. I read it during the rehearsals, cam rehearsals. And finally, when you go for a take, everybody just breaks into laughter. and like, ah, ha, 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 you read it wrong. I'm like, okay, guys, I mean, how old are we right now? It's no longer funny. So but when somebody who is not familiar with the language and he tries really hard, everybody just laughs. So if you can get past that, you can get over yourself. I, I think life becomes a lot easier. If you're in a familiar environment, if uh, all your khakis are there, I mean, like, yeah, okay, you fall down, you dust yourself up, and you carry on walking. But when you're there, you, you are so dependent on someone to give you the right lines, you're so dependent on the script, hopefully the script is not badly written, mm. you're so dependent on your co-stars, you're so not in your element, yeah. right? You just get better, you persevere, you, you give it your all, yeah. and hard work never let anybody down. I think, yes, especially when you look Chinese yeah. but then you don't, the words that come out from you don't sound Chinese. <laughs> I mean, I say it because I'm Baba plus Tzatzing. So it's like double whammy, right? But I look completely Chinese. Yeah, it does, it does hurt me and to be honest, like my mom at work, she uses her maiden name. Mm. But then people still like, eh, hey, why you cannot speak Chinese? And she's like, I'm not Chinese. I, I think it's part of growing up. When you're young, you're insecure, you, you don't know who you are. You don't know who you want to be, yeah. and you you get frustrated. You know, it's just like having acne and all that. But it will stabilize after a while. From a very young age, I I could never understand why it was so hard to understand Mandarin, or why was it so hard to learn. I didn't realize that yeah, you know, you can learn so much in school, but when you go back home and when the environment is all in English, yeah. So Mandarin was non-existent for me. Same. So. <laughs> I would come back home really frustrated and my, my dad would sit me down and say, boy, what's wrong? And I'd say, well, you know, I just cannot score in Mandarin. I just cannot deliver. I'd say, okay, the next time somebody gives you a, a tough time, you just say, I'm Baba. I'm like, so your dad, how old were you when your dad told you this? I think I was still, still was in primary school. Do you understand what that meant at that time? No. Okay, so did you try it? So I was in a cab and so this, this taxi driver was looking back and he just said, hey, you Chinese? I said, yeah, I'm Chinese. Then why your Mandarin so koya? You know why so happy and I so I'm Baba. Immediately there was silence. Then oh, let's see Baba Nanga. Okay, okay, okay. So simple as that. But you see the thing is, years down the road, mm. I joined Media Corp. Yes. And my life depends on it. <laughs> I have to speak in Mandarin. I realized that through the scripts, through the different roles that I play. Mandarin is so powerful, it's so descriptive, it is so beautiful. I wish I could speak it as fluently yeah. as I want to in English. Oh yes, all the time. We, we run yeah. like clockwork, right? We got to be at a certain location, we got to finish a certain scene by a certain time, uh, sometime the weather. Yeah. And so we're so dependent on so many other things. And on top of that, you are engaged. You are supposed to play a character. Yeah. You go there and you can't say your lines. You get you get angry. So it's whether or not people want to be a team player or people want to just be individuals and like what you say. I'm past 40, closing in on 50. My so gosh, this guy, I don't know how he maintains, yeah. When I grow up, I want to be like you. <laughs> You're just like two years away. Shut right? I'm not two years away. Hello, don't be rude. Huh? 